Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Kokila and thanks for visiting. If you haven't already, please go ahead and click the subscribe button. Today I thought of showing you some DIY organizers which are super easy to make. Instead of buying some costly containers from the store, you can make this and save some money. I am currently uh, using this for keeping my jewelry, but it's up to you. You can use this organizer for storing your jewelry or your socks or your ties or even belts. The choices are endless. I'm not gonna make this from scratch right now. I'm just sharing the instructions on how to make it. So let's see the things we need. Take a sturdy cardboard box which you may find at your home. I'm using the tomato box from Casco as you can see. I felt this is much suitable for my needs and you can easily pull it out from a drawer any time. You also need some cardboard for making dividers, scissors, pencil or marker, some glue or E6000 whichever is available, a ruler, some wrapping paper and duct tape. First decide in which way you want to divide the space, either horizontally or vertically. It's as per your needs and uh, what you are going to store. After deciding that, measure the width of the box in the direction you want your divider to go and also the height of the box from the ground. These two measurements equals uh, the length and the height of the separator or divider we are going to make. Now take the cardboard and mark it with the measurements which we have taken previously and cut it accordingly. You can have up to three divider smacks here but please make one first and try to fit it in the box. If you see it's not fitting, just adjust it accordingly by cutting some extra on the edges. Do as many pieces as you want. I used gift wrapper to cover both sides of the cardboard and some duct tape will help to cover the uneven corners and it just adds some color. As you are seeing here, I have again used the gift wrapper to cover the inside of the box and for the outside, I have used the duct tape to give it a good support and a shiny look and uh, this one is from Dollar Tree and you can always get some cute colors and fun designs for just one dollar. And regarding the bottom space, you can just leave it as such. Uh, once you start filling it with things, it will cover the space and uh, who is gonna peek inside. So that's it. Let's go ahead and stick the dividers with the help of glue and let it air dry for a few hours or maybe a day and start using it. This is my lovely collection of bangles. Usually I try to keep it organized but it always becomes a mess. Whenever I'm in a hurry, I try to get a specific bangle but it just always looks like this. I'm just trying to give a short video but you know, I'm just learning. So, please excuse. Guys, none of the jewelry shown here is gold. First row I have my stone studded bangles and other metal bangles which I use along with saris or other traditional dresses and I have a single bangle just for filling the space and on the next row I have my metal bangles which I use more frequently on a daily basis and these are the single ones 
and this one i really like them you can mix and match you can wear it for casuals and also for traditional dresses it just works well it's just so easy to select the one you like and wear it with your favorite dress this is another homemade organizer we are seeing today you can use it to store earrings it's super easy and it doesn't need much work first thing to do just enjoy your chocolates i really love them then wash the boxes and uh, dry it thoroughly if you wish you can remove the stickers i just kept it and it's very thin to take it off then arrange your earrings in the way you love and enjoy i really like to thank all my subscribers and everyone who is watching my videos i am so glad that you have subscribed and supporting my channel please do leave your comments below i love to read each and every one of your comments and if you really like my videos please do give a big thumbs up it will be a great motivation for me to make more videos for you guys so yeah thank you